in the client script page there is one function where we didn't cover okay where we can now see g form okay get action name okay did we cover this part ma by any chance no sir no, no. okay see sir. here returns the most recent action name okay or for client script the sys id of ui action clicked that means you are in a form okay you will be having so many ui actions okay buttons okay so you want to do an activity or you want to know what was last clicked based on that you need to do some job okay if you write get action name okay it gives you the last clicked ui action sys site you're understanding ma yes no no sir no so see here okay so how many ui actions are here many correct yes sir too many okay let's say there is a requirement where i would like to know okay if a create problem button is clicked okay then you need to do something here or i want to make sure i, I have two buttons okay button a button b okay if button a clicked last time then do something or make it mandatory if button b clicked make it non mandatory you are understanding now so you have a yes, field sir. here description field if button a if if create out is clicked last time then it should be mandatory okay if create a uh, problem clicked it should not be mandatory so you want you need a you have a situation where you need to determine what was the last clicked button okay for that you have an option here like get action name okay someone asked this question and he answered it something but i said it's not the one one okay we will see it when we covered uh, ui action did do you want you, you you were able to recollect it ma everyone i was remember it like someone asked it and then i tell i told the same thing yes sir okay to get action name is to get the last clicked ui action fine simple you can just print one thing and then you just create one on load client script or on change client script okay keep okay get action name okay and then leave it and then print it in an alert let's see what it is giving it it give you some ui action and go to that ui action table and match that particular uh, sys id okay with which ui action it is matching it with you are understanding yes no yes sir right so